Well, Catherine Dow's headed to the circus today, and you've got, uh, what are you telling us about now? We saw some well, juggling have, before. Oh, we've got some juggling. I'm actually with the ringmaster, if you will, of everything. This is the president of the Winnipeg Circus Club, Charles Lauder. Charles, tell me a little bit about how, we've got a lot going on here. How do you rein it all in on the on the Sunday when you guys meet and and uh, practice? Well, it is kind of fun because it is, it is just chaos. It is a big gym filled with a good 30, 40 people. And everyone just knows to uh, respect the space and try not to hit each other with uh, various props. Well, try not to hit each other over here. We've got Johnny. He's only 13 years old, an incredible juggler. Tell us a little bit about him. Oh, Johnny's awesome because Johnny is is like the, the, the club's best success story. He didn't juggle before the circus club started. He met one of the founders at Comic-Con and then came to the circus club and then started to learn how to juggle. And now he's one of the best jugglers in Winnipeg and Manitoba. He's, he's uh, yeah, he's pretty up there. So I guess one of the things I find pretty cool is that you can come with no skills whatsoever and you can learn a ton of things. Tell us, how can people kind of join and what are some of the things they can expect to learn if they if they come to the club? Uh, absolutely. Uh, the circus is or the circus club is a all-inclusive non-exclusive group. So yeah, you don't need skills. You can show up and we will teach you um, pretty much whatever you want to learn. You just need to put in the time to learn because this stuff does take time, does take dedication to do it. It's difficult to just pick up three balls. You pick up one ball and start at step one. What kind of, we're learning juggling, we're learning unicycling, is this, are these kind of the typical circus fair? Is that kind of what you can expect to learn when you come out? Well, uh, arguably, if we have someone there that knows how to do it, we have someone there that can probably teach you how to do it. And we have, we have juggling, we have hoops, um, we have clowns. Uh, I'm a clown in real life, we're wearing a lot of makeup right now, as you can't tell. Um, there's um, Diablo, Brola Bola, we have a slack line, um, we have aerialist, but uh, that's usually in a different space because the space we have can't do that. Gymnastics, you name it, we could probably find someone or in the city to teach you how. I gotta, I gotta wonder that that being a clown, it must be nice to kind of learn new tricks from other people and just kind of have a community where everybody can uh, can kind of join and enjoy their passion together. Oh, absolutely! Uh, that is uh, that is one of the bigger focuses of the circus club is just to bring all the different uh, all the different circus type groups in Winnipeg together. So we have like a central space that we can all learn and adapt. And and you might learn something from a group that you wouldn't normally hang out with that you wouldn't learn. From, from say the clowns that I tend to hang out with or the magicians that all the magicians tend to hang out with. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for joining us this morning and coming up next, I'm gonna be speaking with a hula hooper. She was teaching me a few moves earlier and she's actually gonna tell us how it also is really good for your health. It can help with your, uh, help with weight loss too, coming up at 7.42 a.m.